channel. Today we're going to be learning how to make these super cute, very easy Easter Bunny berries. Alright, so I'll just go ahead and go through and show you what we're using today. I have some small candy bunny ears here that I got from my local cake supply store. If you can't find those, I'll link this small bunny ear mold that comes with a bow. Looks like this. Okay, and you can use chocolate or fondant to achieve those ears. And you can color them any color you want. The bow, any color you want. You can paint them gold, like this. Okay. So I already have my strawberries cleaned and dried. And we have our ears ready. So let's get started. So to make the dipping process easier, I'm going to be using some toothpicks, okay? So I'm just going to stick the top of the berry with the toothpick, and this just will make it easier to hold that berry while dipping, okay? So I've melted my white chocolate, okay? We have a good consistency. All right, so we can get started dipping. All the berries have toothpicks. So let's get started. So we're just going to pick up the leaves a bit so that they don't get in the way of the chocolate. Okay, we want to hold it so the leaves are up and with the toothpick. All right, and then we're going to dunk the berry all the way in. You want to make sure that you dip the whole berry, okay, and then allow the chocolate to drip down. And you want to let it drip completely before you set it down so there's no pool of chocolate underneath the berry, okay? As it dries, the chocolate will turn from glossy to kind of matte, all right? So you can see it's still glossy and it's still dripping. So we will allow it to dry completely before setting it down. Okay, so we're almost done. Okay, we're gonna pick those leaves up. This one has a lot of leaves. Okay, we're gonna pick it up. We're gonna dunk it in. We're gonna dip all the way. Okay, so it's completely covered. All right, and we're gonna allow the chocolate to drip down. Okay. And we don't want to set it back down on our parchment until it's completely done dripping. Again, so that we don't have a huge pool of chocolate underneath. Okay. And I am going to double dip that berry. And that just gives it a nice smooth finish and even coat. All right, so that you don't have any crevices or any little indents. It's a nice, smooth coating. Okay. Okay, so all of our berries are dipped. I have our little sample bunny right here. Okay, we're going to attach the candy bunny ears. All right, so I'm just gonna turn them around and we just wanna put a tiny little dab of chocolate on the back. Okay, small little dab. And they are pretty tiny, so just be gentle and delicate with them. You wanna hold them in place so that the chocolate sets. Okay. 
and put them in what would be the center of the little bunny face. Okay. And hold it until it's nice and set on there. Okay, so now that we have so tediously added our little bunny ears, we're gonna take one berry at a time. And I have a bag of chocolate. You can use uh, dark chocolate, milk chocolate. You can use chocolate that's been colored black, black candy melts, whatever you prefer. Okay, I'm using a little bit and I've cut a very small, teeny tiny hole, it's so small. Okay, and we're just going to, in a little wave-like motion, make the eyes and then a small little eyelash. Okay, we're gonna do that on each side. The left one is always harder. Okay, we're gonna do all of the eyes on the bunny. All right, so we've added all of our eyes now. I have another bag of chocolate, pink chocolate, okay, with another very small, teeny tiny tip cut out of the top. Right, and we're just gonna make a little tiny nose. And we're just gonna do it kind of like in a little heart shape. One second. Okay, see if I can do it up close. Okay, so we're going to make the little bunny nose on each one. So all of our bunnies have faces. I have some mini cupcake liners here, okay? So I'm just going to set them out. And we're going to use them to set our little bunny faces in. Okay, so we'll put the berry in and then remove the toothpick. Okay, and there you have it, your little bunny berries.